Yes, good day again. St. Vincent, you remain all of herbs back here again with another video. So I'm being quite a long way overdue. I'm supposed to be doing a video on the Cerasi vine, or as we call it, the Caribbean Corolla. Scientific name Momodica charantia, which belongs to the Cucurbitaceae family of which belongs also the zucchini, the squash, the cucumber and it's also called balsam pear, bitter gourd, bitter melon and it's a tendril vine, a perennial vine which um, can grow up to five meters that is 16 feet and um, as you notice here it's growing on this on this fence on this fence here and um, here we see the yellow flowers from what I read um the it's usually flowers in the northern hemisphere from June to July and fruits from September onwards right and it's um, it has quite the interesting history because um, its origins date back to Africa where the Kong hunter-gatherers used it and um, it was introduced to China in the 14th century you know biologists you know researching on, on the Corella you know found out that um, it was introduced to China in the 14th century thus being spread throughout Asia, South Asia. It's found in the Caribbean. It's found in Africa and Asia. And um, it has quite a lot of medicinal benefits. It's, it's a, a stomachic, meaning that it helps to treat ailments of the stomach, it helps with healing tastes very very bitter as um we would know okay um it's good also for their skin for treating eczema for treating acne for healing wounds for treating ulcers it's also good for weight loss and um studies have shown that um it um does in fact treat uh, diabetes you know it has hypoglycemic activity it also has polypeptides which help to control the insulin levels in the body it um, purifies the blood you know it penetrates deep down to the fat the nervous system the blood okay it helps to cleanse the liver keeps the liver healthy the spleen the stomach helps with um, secretion of bile, helps preventing jaundice, and it's it, it's it's a powerhouse packed with so so many nutrients: vitamin B nine, vitamin B six, vitamin B three, beta carotenes. It's also good for their eyes, helps to prevent macular degeneration which might lead to cataracts okay it has a lot of antioxidants which um, helps fight free radicals which lead to um, chronic diseases even cancer there have been studies shown that um, it does prevent cancer which are the monomer components okay it has alkaloids it has tannins it has flavonoids Okay, it has lots of iron, rich in iron, rich in calcium. Okay, manganese, and also has vitamin E, vitamin K. Okay, vitamin C has more potassium. It's good for your brain health. It's quite the energizer. Gives a lot of energy. Right, and um. In um, different um, countries, you can have 
different varieties, small types, the fruit, large, you know, it's um, usually long, so different places have different varieties, right? Contributes a lot to digestive health. Okay, it has um, dietary fiber, which is important for the bowels. And okay, over here we see um, one of the ripe, ripe fruits just um, fell there and um, disintegrated no more. Okay. So it helps to lower blood glucose levels. So um, if you're a person who has usually has low blood glucose levels, you got to be very careful with this one. It treats um, many different types of cancers: skin cancer, prostate cancer, breast cancer. There are studies done on animals to show that um, it lowers blood glucose levels and even uh, medical experts today, you know, they're in unison with um, traditional medicine uses, you know, confirm, you know, it does um, have all these benefits. And in India, it's known as Kerala, you know, in their um, Ayurvedic medicine, their system, even in their their, um, their scriptures, you know, they, they talk about, you know, using um, this herb, you know, it's very bitter, and um, it's recommended to um, use the, the juice made from it. You can cut cut up the fruit and um, consume it on the morning, which um, gives um, better results than um, taking the tablet form or other forms of intake. Yeah, so um, that's uh, quite that's the it. benefits. So um, cleanse the blood. You know, give so many, so many benefits. Use as a vegetable, and uh, many places has has different um, uses for it in their cuisines, right? So there you have it: bitter gourd, bitter melon, sirasi. Usually in the Caribbean, they make a tea from it. Yep, for colds, for rheumatism, for stomach ailments. Usually you have to take it early in mornings because it's it's an emetic in nature. And it's anti anti telmic telmintic. So um it's quite a lot of benefits. So so much to talk about I can't even fit all in this video. So that's um Corala, Corala, bitter gourd. Yep. Cleanse the body. Thanks again for watching.